Well, just one day after disaster struck their country, 20 Japanese students traveled to Fort Wayne as part of an exchange program. News Channel 15's Drew Blair stopped by Bishop Lures High School today. And Drew, you found out how the timing of this trip is affecting the exchange experience. Right. Mark and Heather, these students live about 500 kilometers away from most of the devastation. That's like the distance between here and Evansville. Now they're half a world away, and the news from back home is just starting to sink in. We left Japan uh, just after the day that the earthquake happened, so we, are, we don't know much about it. The aftershocks from Friday's massive quake continue to rumble in Japan the same day Tasei Nakano and Noriko Shimizu boarded a plane with 20 of their students. I think it's really helped to take the students' minds off of what is going on in Japan. The students and their teachers escaped any personal earthquake effect. They must learn the news from home while on the other side of the world. The true impact of this disaster, they're only starting to see now with the television coverage and uh, what they've been able to read. The group traveled from Fushiki High School to walk the hallways of Bishop Lures. It's an uh, unforgettable experience for them. This week, the students will experience American culture at the school and with host families before returning to the reality at home. I think they know that they're going to be facing uh, a, a big shock when they when they go home and see the the impact on a more personal basis. Students from Japan travel to Bishop Lures once every couple of years. This exchange relationship started 26 years ago, and organizers say Fort Wayne students gain just as much, if not more, from the experience than the traveling students. Okay, thanks, Drew.